The U.S. produces air-breathing hypersonic drones. The U.S. Air Force wants Lidos to create a sizable, air-breathing hypersonic drone capable of handling intelligence, reconnaissance, surveillance, and strike tasks did as world powers continue their unrelenting arms race into the hypersonic age. The U.S. Air Force Research Laboratory verified that Mayhem's new demonstration vehicle for an air-breathing hypersonic propulsion system can be traced back to a budget planning document indicating a proposal to construct a multi-cycle engine. That Mayhem will act as a testbed for dual-mode or combined cycle turbine-based hypersonic propulsion technologies is most definitely made plain by this certification, TBCC. The Mayhem drone shares certain similarities with Lockheed Martin's State Route 72 Son of Blackbird hypersonic manned aircraft, which launches a hypersonic scram using a related groundbreaking combined cycle propulsion system. At runway, subsonic, or even supersonic speeds, the engine is inoperable. Mayhem will use scramjets for propulsion, according to defense contractor Rados, and is described as a expendable hypersonic multi-mission ISR and assault program. This implies that he might not be able to launch himself. You might need to take off with a rocket that has a high enough speed to activate a scramjet. The similar issue also arises when scramjets slow down and land on tarmac. A study of the conceptual design and the system requirements sets the stage for the four and a half year project. Thank you for watching this video. Leave a comment in the comments column and don't forget to subscribe and share. You can see information about the military on our channel.